good morning guys what's up welcome back to another vlog i just parked at the gym and i am so excited to get back into the gym today today is basically like my monday because i went away this past weekend which i think i told you guys about my vlog and if you follow me on instagram then you obviously saw i went to coco beach this past weekend and we made it into like a longer weekend so we didn't get back until yesterday and it was so nice i did not vlog anything. I was barely even on social media. It was so nice to just be in the moment. We were at an Airbnb that was right on the water and we just had such a good time. But I am back and I'm ready to get started with a good productive week. I told you guys last week that I really wanted to get back into the gym. So that's what we're doing this week. And I did get a late start today. It's actually literally almost noon. I'm so embarrassed. My goal today was to wake up really early and go to the gym, but that didn't happen. At the same time, I'm kind of not mad that it's later because I think it'll be more dead in the gym and at this time it'll be really good for me to kind of re-familiarize myself with using gym equipment because it's been so long we had like a four hour drive home and on that drive home i made an entire workout plan for five days a week so monday through friday i will be doing some kind of like body workout at the gym using gym equipment and i created an entire thing on google sheets for myself just like a workout plan um, and I might adjust this as necessary, but that way when I walk into the gym I kind of like have a plan because I think that's what always stresses me out when I go to the gym by myself If I'm not with Chad if I'm not like having you know someone telling me what to do I Get like nervous. I don't know what to do and I will literally just like forget wait does this work out legs wait is this like back? You know like I just get stressed out so I came up with this whole plan and I'm just gonna be following this um, so because yesterday was Monday was supposed to be like my leg day today was supposed to be shoulder and triceps I think I'm just gonna do leg day today because I'd rather get two leg days in this week and skip one of my upper body days just cuz obviously like I'm more focused on my legs and booty but yeah I'm really excited to go get a good workout in I filled up my hydro flask charging my airpods and we're gonna go get a workout on just gonna fake it till I make it because as long as I pretend like I know what I'm doing in my Gymshark matching set like I totally I look like I do this all the time so let's go fake it till we make it just got home from the gym and I feel so amazing I know I say this every time but you guys know that I am very intimidated by going to the gym by myself and I'm trying to just like get over that fear. So that's why I talked about like planning everything out before I even stepped foot in the gym. And I felt so good. I knew exactly what I was doing. I put my headphones in. I pretended like no one else was around me despite the fact that it was pretty busy in there. And I just got such a good workout. And I think by like saying that out loud into the vlog, it kind of holds me accountable. So I'm gonna really try to stick to my routine this week and just get more comfortable with going to the gym. It's like my resolution right now. In honor of going back to the gym, I'm gonna make my old favorite protein shake, the Alani New Confetti Cake Protein Shake with some almond milk in my blender bottle, and then I'm gonna go take a shower. Just took a shower and threw some makeup on and now I'm gonna pack up all the somebody orders that came in over the weekend and I'm gonna try to get those out today. So I'm gonna do it really quick. I only have about six orders to pack. post office now to go drop off these packages and I literally can't walk like when I tell you I'm limping when I walk and when I'm bending down to like grab stuff to pick up the packages and put them like in my bag it hurts so bad I am so concerned for the next couple of days because I know it's gonna be really really bad but that's the price you pay when you take a break from working out you get back into it and it's just awful. I'm back home and I'm gonna make one of these black bean burgers for lunch, just something quick and simple. And I'm also gonna make a cold brew coffee at home because I spent enough money this weekend. So I thought I would save some money and just make my coffee at home. I'm 
gonna show you guys how I make my black bean burger and it's so good like this. So I just make it in the pan obviously and then I put a little bit of spicy brown mustard. This is just French's. If you don't like mustard, you can use something else I guess. Then I get some pickles because I freaking love pickles and I layer it with pickles. And then we put everything but the bagel seasoning on it because everything but the bagel seasoning is so good on pickles alone. So I started adding it to my veggie burgers and black bean burgers and literally so good. It's the best thing ever. I got a little PR package from Pixie, so I thought I would do a little unboxing and see what it is. I love the PR packages I get from them. They're always the best. Nature's true gift, inspiration. Painting with a array of colors and creating a world that is full and bright. The Creative Collection Eye Effects. This is Hazelnut Haze. These are such pretty fall colors. Wow, this couldn't have come at a better time. It's literally September 1st today. These are blushes in Honey Nectar. Such pretty colors. We have Sugar Blossom and it says these are multi-use blush quad giving colors to the cheeks and the eyes. So it's used for both. And this one's another eyeshadow palette in Rosette Ray. Such pretty colors. These are totally like all of the eyeshadow colors that I would use anyway. Just like very warm neutral colors. So I cannot wait to use these. way later now and it is pouring down rain outside if you guys can hear that but i just started some laundry and i finished planning out the next drop i'm so excited this drop has a few more transition pieces to like go into fall but the one after this is gonna have like lots of fall collection stuff so i am so excited I guess I'm gonna make this Kung Pao frozen chicken for dinner tonight and it's vegan so I'm not really sure what the chicken is but it's got quinoa and rice cauliflower, 10 grams of protein. I'm excited to try it. So here's what the final product looks like. It smells amazing like I just ordered Chinese food or something. I don't know what's on TV. I just like having the background noise but oh my gosh this is so good. I'm definitely going to buy this again, probably have it again later this week, like next night that Chad's on shift. How is this vegan if there's chicken in it? And it definitely tastes like chicken, like I don't think it's um, like fake chicken or whatever, like I'm pretty sure it's really chicken. But it's spelled chicken like that, so I think it's like a knockoff chicken, but I swear to you it literally tastes exactly like chicken, it looks like chicken too. Look. That looks like chicken. So good. Chad said I should roll out my legs because they hurt so freaking bad. 